Welcome to Cut Above Tarot Council. Council. La di da da. Ooh, Council. La di da da. Hey, Council. La di da 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 di. Ooh, Council. La di da da. Council, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and other placements. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Get in where you fit in. If you don't find yourself in this video, please check your other placements. And I'll see you there too. Yay, yay. All views are appreciated. Cruising and viewing. And if you're a return subscriber, thank you for your support. If you're thinking about being a subscriber, come on in, friend. Have some fun with me. Have some fun with me. Yeah, yeah. Now, nah, Counselor, this is your April the 1st to the 14th uh, video, okay? Now, we know that uh, March was is a wonderful month, right? Uh, redos, rebirths, start over, wipe the slate clean. I look at the month of March, uh, let's say during the spring solstice, I look at that as being the wheel of fortune and the food card together, okay, and the ace of pentacles, and the ace of swords, mm -hmm. and the ace of, ace of, dang, blast it, you know what I mean, ace, of, I, I look at it as being, yeah, even the death card, everything's starting afresh and new, clean slates, places where you may have made some mistakes or things didn't pan out the way you wanted them to, you got the opportunity to do a redo, a reset, a start over, a try it again, okay, all right, and this time you did it with enthusiasm, okay? You put in some high energy, good energy, okay? And and this is a strong possibility. You got good came back to you. Now, Council, now we're moving on into April. So I wanted to find out. Well, actually, I was prompt to go ahead and do April now. So uh, because uh, they had told me to go ahead and do April now, I'm doing April now. Yeah, yeah. Now, Council, let me tell you. I heard a song ringing in my ears by Calvin Richardson, and it was strong. So. I'm going to try to sing just a little bit of it for you. Just a little bit. Here we go. Lately, baby, you've been acting strange with me. Oh, baby. Every time I try to talk to you, I touch you, baby. You jump clean back from me. You know it ain't right, baby. Tell me what it is. What's going on right now? That would make you, make you want to leave me. Uh-huh. And he say, don't be listening to all that talk with, with them other people saying about me. Mm-hmm. So, uh, counsel, you telling somebody if they planning on leaving you, they might well pack too bad because your ass going to, mm -hmm, or vice versa. That's what they telling you. Uh huh. They ain't gonna let you take this good loving away from them. Hello, somebody. So, counsel, let's get right on in your reading, baby. Find out what the hell, what the hell going on with you, counsel? During the April, the first part of April. Mm hmm. Counsel, you done put the whammy on somebody. Mm hmm. You did it. You did that. You got somebody singing at the moon, baby. Uh huh. All they can say is Castle. Ooh, Castle. Oh, Castle. Ooh, la 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 la. Castle. Counts, you got the two pinnacles at the bottom. You do some juggling or some multitasking. Oh, yes, you. you. You feel a kind of balance right now, cause you gotta be balanced to be riding on the back of a horse, right? Juggling two, uh, two ideas, two thoughts, two people, uh, your money, or uh, multitasking. You're very balanced, okay? When it comes to your money, yeah, your money is good too. All right, all right. Look like you're moving forward, counselor. You're not planning on letting no grass grow up under your feet, but you're moving forward in a situation pertaining to Ace of Swords, okay? After you've got some clarity about something, you decide you're going to keep it moving, keep it pushing. That's what I hear. You're going to have to keep it pushing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was a decision that you had to make. You know the decision you had to make. I mean, you didn't want to make this decision. The reason you didn't want to make it because you was totally trying to ignore it just to see if it was going to pass on by. But you got the Six of Cups here, right? All right? And then the Six of Cups talking about somebody was sharing. Okay? Somebody sharing. Maybe you sharing. 
Maybe you're sharing with some children. And maybe you're ready to cut it out. But whatever it is, counsel, you already know about it. You was trying to ignore it. You was hoping that it would just blow over. And you say, you know what? I got to entertain this now. I don't have no choice. I got to go ahead on and put some energy towards the cell. Focus on the cell and make a decision. Cut it out. So when you do cut it out, you're going you're gonna to be successful. Six of cups. All right. You'll be able to have enough to share with your, your little peoples or your big peeps. Okay. All right. You'll be doing some reminiscing. Let's see what kind of reminiscing. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna be thinking about how you can make your things work. You got other you got other, a bunch of ideas, okay? You got choices like a mofo now, uh-huh, to bring stability to yourself and be stable, okay? Yeah, yeah. Not only that, yeah, it's gonna make you abundant. Hey, hey, you're gonna be looking abundant, feeling abundant, mm-hmm. And while you're feeling that, you're gonna be moving on down the road, like uh like they say in the whiz, ease on down the road. Don't you carry nothing that may be a load. Ease on down the freaking road. Mm-hmm. Cancer, four pentacles. Yeah. Now, there are some counselors that's going to be sitting on their money because they're waiting on a message. And when you get this message, you're going to move fast on it. Yes, you are. All right. Yeah, you having some. You having to have some strength right now not to blow your money or spend your money right now. Okay, because you're waiting on this to come in. And when you get this message, this is going to be a message of importance. And so, yeah, you got to be strong. Because it's coming in. All right. There you go. Queen of Queen, the Queen of Swords. Yep. You're gonna go ahead and cut something off. People, places, and things, because you want to get this done. Yeah, now you're looking back on like dang, how much time you wasted, you know? Okay, or or else it might have been a disappointment, okay, in the past pertaining to some finances. However, it looked like you were disappointed, okay? Maybe you missed an opportunity, or maybe you're not gonna take a this uh leap of faith, okay? And you're gonna miss this opportunity. All right. But God, okay, you got to hide from here, all right, all right. No, oh yeah, this is Paulina's tarot deck, right? Yeah, yeah. Some things you got to go <laughs> go back and check it out. Okay, so we got the hide from on the Ace of Pentacles. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Come on, y'all. Mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. So look like you're getting some uh look like you're gonna be getting some uh counseling or some wise words pertaining to some finances, okay? Uh yeah, the reason I say finances because you got this ace of pinnacles. All right. This ace of pinnacles right here. Okay, higher for Oh, you're gonna end up having to pay somebody that's in the judicial system, uh, uh some some money. Mm -hmm. But here it says a wise teacher guidance. Somebody's offering you some knowledge, okay, and it, and it's growing, all right. So and this that's what it means in this deck, all right. So you somebody's giving you getting some wise words, some wisdom pertaining to some finances, and you right now being the Ace of Pentacles, your money is looking good, and now you want to grow that money, okay? You want it to continue to grow for you. You look like you might be wanting to do some investment, diversify all kind of stuff, open up your own business, start from scratch. You know what I'm saying? I can't call it. All right, all right. So let's see what's going on in the second week of April. For you, counsel. What's going on for counsel in the second week? In the second week of April, look like they're telling you to go with the flow, all right? All right? And they're telling you that by you letting down some of your walls, uh, that you will be able to, uh, you, by you letting, no, they say by you letting down your walls, you're going to end up getting some justice, some healing in your bodies, bringing some balance in to you, some harmony and some peace, okay? By you being vulnerable, you're allowing yourself to be a little bit more vulnerable. Okay, you're allowing you this way by you doing that, you're letting your walls down and stuff. You know, smelling the roses, so to speak, uh, walking uh, walking through the park, maybe kicking your feet around in, in the pond where the duck's at. You know, something like that. While you're letting down some of your walls, not all of them, but some of your walls, you and going with the flow because they want you to go with the flow. The hips, baby, go with the flow. Okay? Okay? Yeah. You're getting some healing. Got to tell you that. You're getting some healing. You got the healing card twice. Look at that. DNA. Look at the snake going up. Okay? All right? You're getting some healing. Okay? Justice card. That's a double healing right there. A double healing. 
healing. It could be making sure you understand that you're about to get a strong healing. Either in your body, your finances, might be all the way across the board, but you're going to feel the anointing, baby. The anointing is what destroys the yokes. Okay, the yoke, the yoke of bondage, the yoke of being broke, whatever the the yoke is in your life is about to be destroyed. Okay, so this is healing, baby. Okay, mm -hmm. this is healing and justice. And you might have been hollering out, talking about, I want some dang blasted justice. I'm, I'm trying to be kind, y'all. You know, I'm trying not to say the motherfucker word. But you want some you want some justice. And I want some god dang blasted justice. Give me some freaking justice. Okay. You got it. You you, you called on it. It's coming. All right, counselor? And then you moving the hell on. You say, I think I better leave. You alone. Pack my bags. And get the hell on. Cause I don't want you here no more. Mm-hmm. All right, counsel. What else going on? Counsel, you have the five of swords. All right. You got your mind made up and your heart fixed. I'm going to fight for this shit. I mean what I say and I say what I meant. I meant what I said and I said what I meant. I ain't losing. I'm not going out like no sucker. I knew it, baby. Mm-hmm. And, and by you saying that, look at that. Because you, you you got your mind made up, baby. Okay? Yeah. You've been calculating and thinking and figuring and all kind of stuff. But you, you got your mind made up. It ain't, it ain't no swaying. Ain't no swaying in that at all. All right? Yeah. Nine of, nine, uh, page of wands. Page of wands. I don't know why I said nine. Page of wands here. Okay, so you thinking, hmm, now this deck is saying, which way should I go? What should I do? What can I do? Okay. I'm a king. Am I all right? Where will I, where, where do I want to put my palace? Where I want to put my, my, my castle? Okay. Or where do I want to build my throne? Okay. Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. Other people ain't going to get that. All right. So let's see what the page Page of Wands is in this deck. Z page. Oh, the Z page. Z page. Okay. So this is somebody uh, shouting out a good news. They shouting out a message. A good news is on its way. And they telling you, don't be shy. Make your voice be heard. All right. Don't be shy. What you shy about? Shoot. When you get to a certain age, you're going to be like, fuck that. Let me say what's on my mind. I know it. Yep. The king of king of uh, cups and the page of cups. And the king of cups and the page of cups. All right, counsel. King of cups, all right? All right, having all your emotions and stuff in check, okay, and balance, able to leave, all right? Not having your emotions on your sleeve. Can't nobody sway you. Just because you're a compassionate person and you love them don't mean that you're a pushover. So, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just telling you what I what I hear. Okay? Okay, page of swords. Look like you're gonna be doing some drinking. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. <laughs> yeah. All right. So somebody gonna somebody gonna reach out to you because they got a message they wanna tell you. Okay, they got something they wanna say. And and counselor, I don't know why, but I, I, I hear that somebody it wants to tell you that they are pregnant. That's all I'm going to say on that. I ain't going to say nothing else. That gave me a headache right there. Uh huh. You might get that same damn headache when somebody come at you with that. All I can say, I'm going to just say like this here. See this card say? What does it say? DNA. DNA. That's all I'm going to say. All right, Kelsey, I enjoy doing your reading. All right, for April the 1st to the 14th, 2023, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. All right, please comment. I enjoy reading your comments. They inspire me to continue to move forward, okay, and to listen to my guides, all right, and convey to you the messages that I get. All right, I love you. Y'all have a wonderful day, evening, and weekend. See you again. Yay, yay.